most accurate local forecast starts now with meteorologist Brett Thackeron. Great to be with you on a, a Tuesday morning, everybody. This is downtown Elizabethtown and another nice day on tap. Uh, we've got uh, warm temperatures and uh, basically another sunny day, although that's smoke. We're going to track that for you too. kind of uh, made for a smoky sky yesterday. 55. It's a comfortable morning. How great is it to throw open the windows right this time of year? We don't have to close things down uh, every night and uh, crank the AC. At least it hasn't been that way, and uh, it's been a nice spring from that regard. 79 again, three days in a row yesterday just could not crack the 80 degree mark. No rain, and now we're right at or just slightly under a four inch deficit, so we could desperately use the rain. The records uh, in May uh, usually in the 90s. Today's record is 94. We will not be that warm, likely topping off in the upper 70s. Again, we have a few clouds to the south. There's going to be some cumulus clouds around today in addition to the wildfire smoke. So like yesterday, the sun is going to be tempered a bit, but it's still going to be a nice enough day. We do not expect any rain today. High pressure is still in control. We are starting in the 50s from 57 in Harrisburg down into the low 50s in York and Lebanon. 55 in Lancaster and Philly, and then some 60s off to the south. If you're headed to Baltimore this morning, you're going to be a little bit warmer there at 60 degrees. So there's no major systems at play. We've got high pressure in control here to the north and east. We do have some smoke that's going to be drifting overhead from the wildfires in Canada, and then we've got a few cumulus clouds, but we don't see any rain. There's no major weather at play. So let's talk about this smoke forecast. You can see it here in orange. This is going to be around creating hazy skies and kind of that whitish hue to the sky rather than a perfectly blue sky, and that's going to be with us here tomorrow. You can also see this front tomorrow evening that we've been mentioning that could spark off a few showers. That's going to help to clear the smoke out as well, and our next area of high pressure will keep things uh, more blue out there. A blue sky on Thursday and Friday, so the smoke starts to dissipate here later in the week. Now, until that point, some smoky sunshine. It's going to be warm and dry here, thanks in large part to that high pressure, and then a front really separating a couple of areas of high pressure that will uh, end the week for us here, but the front in between on Wednesday night will produce a few showers. The front well to the north right now, but it's going to drop in and kind of die out over top of us. So watch what happens here. Kind of a smoky, hazy sunshine today, but it will be around. Temperatures will be in the 70s. Tomorrow we start sunny, a nice day, but watch what happens by tomorrow evening. We start to see the clouds increase. There could be one or two showers around in our northern two counties. This front really dies out. I think by the time it heads south of the turnpike, there's not going to be much uh, left. So uh, rainfall chances and rainfall itself looks sparse tomorrow. The clouds clear out. Thursday looks like an absolutely gorgeous day. Low humidity and cooler temperatures here near 70 degrees. Uh, the winds are going to pick up too right along the front. Uh, you can see here by Wednesday evening, quite gusty winds at 15 to 20 miles an hour, and it stays a bit breezy on Thursday behind the front winds coming in from the northeast at about 10 to 15 miles an hour. So the extended outlook showing you again the ridge building in. We've got an upper level low, though, that will keep us cool here for Thursday and Friday, and then we want to watch this coastal storm over the weekend. Still looks warm enough for us, but the question will be where does that rain go right now? Most of it looks to stay to our south, leaving us with just a few stray showers and no washouts for the holiday weekend. Again, good news, although we do need the rain. The average high right now is 76. We see that increasing 82 tomorrow looking good and then a little bit cooler here Thursday and Friday, but we start going back up. Uh, toward average here over the weekend. So today 78 partly cloudy skies, kind of a smoky haze out there again, like we've been dealing with becoming mainly clear tonight. Again, open the windows, let some fresh air in temperatures in the 40s to near 50 degrees, cooling off of it by the end of the week, but sunny. Look at that. Looks good. Mostly sunny on Saturday now. And then well, uh, some clouds are going to be overhead for Sunday and Monday, uh, maybe just a few stray showers. It is hard to break a dry pattern. We certainly don't see that happening. So a lot of the rain staying away. Uh, we'll keep monitoring it, though. It's close. It's very close. But mm -hmm. uh, right now, the weekend looking OK. And tomorrow night, we're just seeing like scattered. Not a big deal. Don't cancel any evening plans. I wouldn't know. Very light, if anything at all. And uh, unfortunately, that looks like our best chance for rain in the next week. So it'd be nice wow. to get some. But yeah. I don't see a lot coming, though. No. OK, thank you, Brett. Mm -hmm. It is time for this morning's